your family welcome to the chichi show wow 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 we just hit twenty thousand subscribers thank you so much we thank god for everything we want to thank everyone that has ever come across the chichi show thank you so much those that subscribe my subscribers my members thank you so so very much we really appreciate each and every one of you Thank you for your support and keep supporting the Chichi Show. So today we're going to be looking at um, uh, hopper jobs. So uh, whatever job that you are doing as a mechanic, as a welder, we're going to be looking at the hopper jobs. Okay. So um, before we look at in, uh, look into these hopper jobs, uh, the reason why this hopper job is cool is that uh, whatever you're doing back home uh maybe you are in let me just say a plumber and back home you can start as a plumber helper so when you work as a plumber helper uh this employer we want to hire you because he knows that okay you have this experience in this area as a plumber before so you have, you have an idea of what to do even though they've indicated it that they don't need education they don't need um they don't need um no education no experience so if you still don't have experience you in this uh, as a helper as a plumber you can still apply because helper don't really need to have any form of training uh you just you are just there to assist the main uh guy the main plumber i'm just using plumber as an example so uh that's it for today's job but before we get to see today's job i'm gonna put uh show us how we write the resume and the cv for this hopper job so uh here now we have this uh cv here so at this at the top here you put your name below here you put your contact information uh your address your phone number and your email address so uh the button here you like you try and write uh try to say a little bit of that helper job okay a little bit of what name let's say uh for this one is uh uh as a teacher assistant so that's it for the, that's the, the what this resume is all about the person that created this uh resume is a is a is an assistant teacher assistant so uh so it's just for summary uh assistant teacher responsible like some me just a little bit of what you do uh responsible assistant teacher with excellence you know you're gonna sell yourself here so at this summary here you kind of sell yourself okay uh so this person says responsible assistant teacher with excellent communication and coordination skills you know demonstrated by eight years of classroom experience you know something like that you will just sell yourself okay um so maybe here she she is already an assistant teacher but you that is a plumber before you just sell yourself as a plumber okay what you do as a plumber whatever job that you are doing back up because the job you are looking at today they are saying no experience no uh high education so whatever you are doing back home whatever you are doing presently that's what you will put here so you just sell yourself here if you are a teacher you just sell yourself here put it here okay indicate it here just tell give the the employer an idea of what you do like your good qualities so you put it here so at uh, this next column you put your highlight uh, highlights like excellent classroom management like your skills what you do you know you put it here like in a short form now okay like this uh teacher assistant said excellent classroom management teaching uh tutorial and uh, counseling you know a CPRO certification that she has CPRO. You just put all those little little details that the employer that will interest the employer about you. Then so the next place is to for you to put your experience. Uh, so if you've no if you whatever that you were doing before, okay. Even though this employer has said he doesn't want experience, that means he doesn't want experience in this particular job. 
okay but that doesn't mean that you will not put it there so that your the, your previous experience so that this employer will know that oh you have you've worked before okay you know how a work setting look like so you put it whatever that you are doing now you put all your experience here so two options you can put uh your maybe let's say this one a teacher assistant you can put january to current here or uh, january 2011 to in to current here or you put the date here it's optional is either you put the date under the uh, job title or you put it at the right hand side okay so uh, something you need to know again is uh you start from your most current job okay don't pull the job that you put nine you did 98 uh, uh, 90 something you put it out of uh, at the beginning no you put your most current uh job at the top and you keep going like that current 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 to the to the last okay to the oldest so you go from the newest let me put it this way you go from the newest job to the oldest oldest job okay so um so here that's where you put your ed education uh, i have bs in this i have high school whatever form of education that you have then you put it at the bottom here so uh what i always say so at this side okay you you at this place here you can put uh your your reference contact information so you can just put somebody's name like your supervisor or something name here and the contact information okay so that's it for how you do the resume so now we're gonna look at the available jobs that was going to be seen today so now you know how to write your resume for these jobs that will be seen today so a uh, happy new month happy new month the chichi show family um this may is gonna be a good month for all of us it's gonna be a month of answers prayer answer prayer answer prayers in jesus name amen uh so we have at us today canada has 374 available helper jobs with no experience and no education so um if you when they say no experience if you've ever want to work as a helper then you can apply for this job uh so this job is in suri bc um the full-time job no degree no experience and the employers have said we should apply this way so most of you keep reaching out to me to say chichi uh we can't say she is we can't share search job bank we can't get it you know what the best way for you to get it is by watching these videos okay that's the reason i just call out the email address so that it's gonna be easy for you all you need to do is to attach your resume to this email so that's why you have the chichi show that's why you have subscribed to the chichi show for me to be bringing out these jobs to you guys so this one now uh i do give you guys the email address so you, all you need to know because do because that's what the employer has said you should do uh, uh that you should apply how to apply apply by email so the email address i'm gonna be calling it to you b this one is b l a c k s t a double r o e p a i r o one two three at gmail.com all together okay that's just that the name of this it has black star black star repair one two tv at gmail.com black star repair one two tv at gmail.com i really i'll call it that again b l a c k s t a double r o e p a i r o one two tv at gmail.com so that's it for the mechanic helper if you ever want to go into it here as a mechanic this 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 one for you all these jobs are pretty new jobs they are new jobs uh 
that was posted yesterday so um this one is Can canadian uh, railway oh boy this is a good job and they are looking for welder helper and uh, they said they are going to pay 20 dollars an hour 21 dollars an hour for 40 hours a week and uh, no experience no education okay and uh, okay so maybe i should be giving you guys the noc code so that you can use it to write your resume so the noc code for this world helper is 9612 9612 and the email address i used to apply a uh, canadian railing at at outlook.com c-a-n-a-d-i-a-n-r-o-a-i-l-i-n-g at outlook.com so uh the noc code for this job is 9612 okay uh so the next uh we're gonna be looking at is roofer helper roofer helper all these jobs are pretty new several vacancies uh height roofing high roofing uh, roofing and water uh, proving limited and they are going to be paying once they buy this uh, um, helper job they pay pretty good they pay pretty good and uh, the NOC code for this roofer helper is 7611 and uh, it's on the road job on the road job so you know they have several vacancies no education no degree work location may vary frequent cost travel is required for this employee so just know that that you are going to be moving and uh, around so you work location various locations on the workplace information on the road job so just to let you know and this employer is is uh the email address is h e i g h t r o double o f i n g at gmail.com noc code is seven six one one seven six one one the next we're gonna look at is capital helper so these jobs you can see that you don't need to be a capital they you are just an helper so these guys okay so maybe helping them to lift bring the this bring that bring that helping the cap the main capital guy so no degree no experience needed uh for five dollars hourly uh, you work in residential and uh, you work the location is very various, various locations so you're gonna be traveling or moving and how to apply said um, by email so this email address and who can apply those uh, Canadian citizens are permanent residents of Canada other candidates with or without a valid Canadian work permit can apply so westcoast.manpower at gmail.com west w e s t together c o a s t dot n a n p o w e w e r West host together, then dot the manpower at gmail.com. Okay, so uh, the NOC code for this job is 7611. 7611. So the next one we're going to look at is construction helper. Construction helper, two vacancies. Uh, this job is in Suri, BC and the noc code 2 is 7611 no education no degree and uh, yes the way you apply for this job is one plus one so one then p l u s one 
then construction at gmail.com there's something i'm saying here now so uh one plus one so the plus is one number one then plus p l u s then one then construction c o all together c o n s t r o u c t i o n at gmail.com okay and the noc code for this job is 7611 7611 so uh the next job we're going to be looking at is a uh, driver helper mm -hmm. driver helper so one vacancy um they said they are going to be paying six hundred dollars weekly not bad and uh, the noc code is seven six two two and so you're going to be with the truck driver you're going to be assisting the truck driver okay so education no education experience they said they will train so you don't need to have experience they will train you so specific skills assist trucks and delivering drivers to load and unload vehicles so they have so many benefit care health benefit disability benefits all the benefit you can think of uh, as a helper driver helping the 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 uh truck the main truck guy so the email address you use to apply is d double d little small letter double d s a l e s at n f dot a i b n dot com uh if you want to find their fax number is seven o nine six three four two four seven one okay and so the next we're gonna we're gonna look at uh another capital helper and the noc code is 7611 most of these separate jobs the noc code is 7611 and tv vacancies is in delta bc no experience uh no no degree this implies the experience is an asset okay uh so how to apply is um one zero that is ten forty nine then triple tri zero so one number one zero four nine zero 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 dot jobs at gmail.com so we're going to be stopping here today if you haven't subscribed to this amazing channel you want to smash that subscribe button Hit the like button, turn your notification bell so that next time we will upload a good video like this, you will be notified. For my old and new subscribers, thank you so very much. Happy new month again. Enjoy your month. Enjoy your, the rest of your day. And have a blessed month. See you in my next one. Be good and be safe. Bye.